name is Emilio Melendez, and today's topic is what is SEO? The S stands for search, the E stands for engine, and the O stands for optimization. Again, SEO, search, engine, optimization. Now, what are search engines? Most people have heard of Google, Yahoo, MSN, Bing, and many, many more search engines. Actually, there are thousands and thousands of search engines. Now, I'm going to take you to several search engines, and if I disappear, it's just because I'm working with my keyboard or my mouse to show you these different screens. So first, let's go to Google. Now, most of you have seen the Google search engine, and basically what you do is you put in a word, you put in a phrase, or what we call keywords. That, these are words that are helping you find the product or the service you're looking for. For example, let's say I'm looking for apartments in Miami. So I would put in a word, Miami Apartments. Now, once I put this in, I click on the Google search, and Google will list different websites that have a relationship with these keywords, Miami Apartments. Now, remember that I'm telling you words, phrases, and hmm, I'm using a lot the word keywords. I'm using this because I want to start you to understand why we use the term keyword. And please write this down if you can. So this is one of the search engines. I'm going to disappear again. Yahoo. How many of you have ever used Yahoo? Same concept. You put in a word, you put in a phrase, you click on web search, and voila, you'll have different websites related to that word, phrase, or keywords. Now, let's look at another search engine that's very popular also. Bing. Let me explain the same concept. You put in this little box here, you put in a word, a phrase, or what we call keywords to find what you're looking for. Now, anyone that has a business would be asking themselves, why is this so important? Why are the search engines so important? Why should I have a website? Why maybe should I really think of doing search engine optimization on my website? Well, maybe three billion might help you make your decision. Again, three B billion dollars were sold last year through search engine optimizations. Those are products and services. Now, I'm going back to Google just to show you something very, very important. And I'm using Miami Apartments, and I clicked on the Google search. Now, there's something very, very important that everyone should know. As you can see here, it says sponsored links and sponsored links. And this is the right rail, sorry, uh, and this is here the top of the search engine. Now, as you can see, these here are what you call pay-per-click, or known as PPC. I can remember eight years ago when these cost one cent. Can you believe it? One cent. Now the minimum purchase is 10 cents, but they're really going for dollars. Some are 10, 20, 30 dollars a click. Some are hundreds of dollars. What does this mean? This means every time someone clicks on any of these titles, this is the website, you will be charged whatever the pay-per-click is at that moment. Again, 
the first three and all of these here on the right hand side are paper flicks. Now, the other option that you have is organic SEO. Organic SEO is everything that appears in this white section in the middle. I'm going to move here. Again, SEO, sponsored links, sponsored links. Everything that's here in the white area is organic. Organic means that you actually do not have to pay for it. Organic means that you will be creating some aspects on your website that will help these search engines find your website. Now, we are going to be discussing the differences between organic and pay-per-click in some other courses that we're going to be giving. But the most important thing here, again, is these are the ones you pay for up on the top, on this side, and these are the ones you program for. Okay? PPC, pay-per-click, organic. You do not pay any of the search engine for doing this. So I hope you learned something. The most important things were that we discussed what is SEO. SEO means search engine optimization. We also discussed some of the most common search engines. We said Google, Yahoo, MSN, Bing, and thousands and thousands of more. Why are search engines so important? They help you sell or find a product or service that you're looking for. What different types of search engine processing can you do? You can do pay-per-click on the top and on the side, which means PPC, pay-per-click. And you can do organic. Everything that's on the white area down here is organic search engine optimization. I hope this is I hope this has helped you understand just a little bit of what SEO really is. And I also hope that you see my other videos explaining everything else related to SEO. Thank you very, very much for listening to me and have a great SEO day. Bye bye.